Welcome back. So if you are looking for something fun to do this weekend, you might want to think about having some laughs at the Tampa Improv in Ybor City. Oh, yes, yeah, always a good time. One of the headliners this weekend is actor and comedian known as Da Vinci. He's joining us live now. Good morning to you. Hey, good morning. How you guys doing? <laughs> we are doing well. Thanks for spending some time with us. Hey, your acting career just started mm -hmm. a few years ago, right? But you've had some major roles. Folks might recognize you from All American, but most recently starring as Terry Flinnery in the hit star show BMF. For those who are unfamiliar with BMF, kind of explain it to our community. So BMF is a story about um, two brothers who ran one of the largest domestic drug distributions in the history of America. And um, they end up becoming very influential in hip hop. Uh, a lot of hip hop artists, you know, listen to their lyrics that they they make references to them because what these brothers did was very like, like it, it was very historical. <laughs> well, you know, you've recently opened up about your sudden rise in fame, which I'm sure is just very different. How has that impacted your mental health? And what is your advice to young boys and people who are dreaming of being in your shoes right now? Um, I, I would definitely say you, um, be, when, when you pray for rain, you got to deal with the mud too. And I, I didn't, that's one of the things that I remember hearing Denzel say, and I'm like, what does that mean really? You know, but you know, when you're, you know, blessed and fortunate enough to be in this position, you start realizing that it's not really always cracked out to be, and you really got to make sure you guard your mental health a lot, whether, whether that's through therapy, whether that's through your faith in God or, or whatever, but you need to find a way to set certain balances in your brain because this business is not a business that that's really conducive to a healthy mindset due to your exposure to the amount of people that it's not normal for the average person to go through. So you definitely got to take certain serious measures with keeping that your brain at a, a homeostasis, you know, state. Yeah, so, you know, yourself, yeah. That's... Absolutely, especially because the people love you. Now, hey, you're gonna be here <laughs> in Tampa, not acting though. So actually when I saw mm -hmm. that he was coming at the improv and you were coming, I was like, for comedy? <laughs> so how long have you been yeah. doing comedy? Kind of tell us what people can expect. Uh, I've kind of been doing comedy like for a while now, but taking it more serious as the last, you know, couple months. And uh, I think people can expect to be surprised and to laugh a lot, and have a good time. And I think you're going to get to see another side of myself. So it's going to be it's going to be a nice little experience. Well, you do it all from it's acting to comedian. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. you actually started um, kind of doing spoken word. So is that what kind of transitioned yeah. to the comedian aspect? Uh, no. So I was doing spoken words and then rapping, but then I was like, uh, I can't stay in the music business because of certain, certain things. But I think comedy came from, I did Broadway a year, two years ago in New York. And that was a, that was a hell of an experience mm -hmm. doing that, being on stage, being, being able to perform in front of a live crowd and hearing their gasp, hearing their laugh, hearing them cry with you like right then and there. So I think that was definitely a fuel that kind of started it and you know I've been watching comedy like religiously for like eight ten years since I was like a little teenager so I'm like you know what I want to you know give this a shot one day and you never know if I fail then it's a story to tell and if <laughs> I don't then you never know absolutely well hey Da Vinci thanks for spending some time with us this morning I'll be there in the crowd so I'll let everybody know if you are actually funny or not <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate that so much. <laughs> no problem. Hey, you can see Da Vinci and Friends Sunday night at the Tampa Improv. That show starts at 7 in the evening. Doors open at 6 o'clock in the morning. It's a first come, first serve basis. Tickets are available at improvtampa.com. And a big thanks to Da Vinci for joining us this morning.